Okay, this is the 10 second timing, how to calculate and do the math from the 10 second timing. Let's start with how long did your, how far did your car go in 10 seconds? So after your car goes for 10 seconds and you count out how many feet, let's say for our example right now, it goes 15 feet. So what we'll do is we'll go to our worksheet and we'll type in 15, all right? at a 10 second timing and then we'll come here and we'll calculate out how many feet per second so we're going to say 15 feet enter that's 1.5 feet per second so i'm going to come back here and i'm going to type in 1.5 that's our new rate of which our car will move uh, per second so what does that mean here what we did is we said uh, for our car to go 15 feet, 10 seconds for uh, our wait time, we know that that went 15 feet. Now, let's say, for example, we would like our car to go 20 feet. So if we want our car to go 20 feet, we have to go back to the calculator, make sure we have the 15 up there. I'm going to type in 20 feet and hit enter and it will give me a wait time of 13.3. So I'm gonna go back to my code, 20 feet, 13.3 seconds. So if we run this code right here, my car will go 20 feet because in 13.3 seconds, that's the distance it will travel, okay? So what if, for example, we would like to go six feet? Well, let's go back to the calculator. Let's switch that to six feet and hit enter, four seconds. So if we would like it to go six feet, we would go to our wait time and change it to four seconds. That is how to do your calculator math of uh, your distance timings. So the math works like this. Your car goes 15 feet, and then we divide that by, uh, hold on, it, we divide 15 feet by 10 seconds, and it will give us how many feet a car travels each second. Now, in our example here, six feet is what we'd like the distance to be. So it's six feet divided by 1.5, and that gives us four seconds. So that's how the math goes. You're simply dividing all the way down. So this is how to use the calculator for your distance timings for all of your challenges. Located at Applied STEM Lab, under Automation and Robotics, Calculator Feet Per Second page. Or it's linked in your worksheet as well as in all of the presentations. There you go.